so I'm making a card with the Autumn Day set. I use some just normal white paper. I never use my my paint paper stock because I don't know. Just grab this. So I just coloured it with a cheap paints from uh, Amazon. Look at the mess. Alright, so I just painted it on. Made a kind of like um, autumn scene. Why is that shaking? And then cut it out. I did some embossing, but I don't know. This, the embossing powder I've got is it's never stuck. And then this was too dark. So. Alright, so I'm gonna die cut the back in a minute. I'm going to do some hopefully embossing. I don't know. I don't know if it's this one I bought. It's just not as good. I had a Dovecraft one. It was really good. A lot of times this stuff does not stick for some weird reason. I mean, you can see it looks wet, but then when you actually go to emboss, it doesn't happen. Right, I'll try my new red. Mm. So you can see the wetness there. I don't see it up here in the middle bit. Shouldn't be this hard. Can then mix embossing less fun when you've got to go through so much hassle to get it to work. Fingers crossed. Let's put a paper. No, I don't think it's caught in the top again. So annoying. So annoying. stuck. I don't know if it's going to be that clear up here though. Nah, I've got a feeling it's not going to show up as good as it should. Very annoying. Colour's gorgeous, but it's just knows that bit there's rubbish, that bit there's rubbish. That bit there's not very good either. So annoying. I need to do it again. If you can see it's the Boston powder's beautiful, but it's just not stamped nice. Let's turn it over and do it on the other side. There's the other. I never used the the pad. This is supposed to help with embossing, but use the pad so you don't get bits sticking everywhere, which I did anyway. But I never used the pad on this, and it actually seemed to come out a bit better, but still, that's smudged. That's it's infuriating, because I want to use that red. It's gorgeous. And I hope there's not too much shadow. I'm just going to do the inside of that blending, because it's just a bit too white. Oh my god, that was one dip. Look how strong that is. Right, so... Now oh, that's a bit better. I wonder if I should make it darker or not. 
we'll go with that just now. I might change my mind later on. Right, so that's that done. Um, I cut some trees and then sprayed them with the bronze. Was it bronze? Bronze. That's just, um, what is it? Just, I had a bag. Envelope, I should say, and just cut it from them because I wanted a, a light brown. And I've cut some dyes that I've shoved in this wee pot here. Oh, I think I put the stamps away. It was, um, was it Woodland Creatures magazine or something? Oh, I think I put the things away that I need and then things I don't need to keep. So they're just going to be on there somewhere. That's my acorn die. I don't know where the new one went that goes in that, that stamp set because it's me. Right, I've changed my mind again. <laughs> Instead of adding, hopefully this is not going to screw up the card. I'm going to actually stamp it right onto the gold card. I'll keep the pumpkins for something else because they're very nice. This is um, that's a hobby craft. It's a shame it's getting really done, but it's I find it's real good ink. Fingers crossed. Hopefully, this is catching on the camera. Yeah, that's nice. You see that? Whoopsie. See it? I like that other ink, but it's just too wet. Dovecraft, it's really wet, so. Storing it upside down is not a good plan either, because it's going to make it wet. I needed somewhere to put my dyes. Right, that looks good. I like it though, it looks good. Pine cone. Pine cone. Yeah, if it's horrible, I'm going to cover it with something. It's a shame I really wanted to use that as a last one. So, yeah, but. Because well, I like the sentiment, but it's just, I think it's far too big for the card up too much space. Smaller sentiment. Again, it's a shame because the sentiments are nice, but it's a bit large. Um, I think maybe just autumn leaves are falling. It's funny, it's a nightmare to be stamped off. But once they're off, you can get them stuck back on again. Still big, but not as big. Right, let's do this. That's cute. So I should put it that way. Nice. Yes, it looks good on the gold. Just got to be careful, I don't smudge it. Right, put it over there to dry. Eh, uh, where's the sentiment? Seriously. <laughs> Pick something up, drop something else. 
Oopsie. Right. This card is taking forever. Cut this out. Shape. I was going to do this shape, but it's really like a tiny, tiny bit smaller. I'm hoping this is getting caught in karma, just looking, I can't really tell. But I hope so, because I don't want to do it all again. Right, so I've stuck out in the middle. I'm going to get put on the leaves. Cut the leaves. Um, so I'll get this die. It came with a tree. Got some wee apples and stuff as well. But I don't know how long ago for that die. It's quite a while. But so the leaves are very handy for this. Where be my glue? Start sticking the leaves on. I don't want to sit here and do it. I'm calm and bored every day to death, but I'll do a few of them just to start. Right, so I've got a few different colours. Right, so just build the map. Too much glue on them. It's too much. Right, I'll build that up. Um, I need to get animals. Okay, I've got the deer. Got the wee rabbit. A hedgehog. I'm putting the hedgehog in the leaves. Um, I was going to put a bargain on this, but I think it's going to be too wide again. I find it annoying if the sentiment takes the whole card up. Especially if you're doing a building up. Which I'm doing here. Oh, there's a bird somewhere. Where's the wee birdie? Oh boy. I've got to wait through all this lot. Oh yeah, just stick your fingers right in the glue. And I'll just stick it down. Right. Caught an ass.
Right, as I said, I'll be putting that there. I'm sorry, I don't know, that sentiment is annoying me as well. <laughs> Never happy. <clears throat> Right, I figured I'll just put the sentiment on. If I don't, I'm going to spend the whole night just mumbling and grumbling and changing my mind. Just let's get it on. Yeah, good. Okay. I don't know if I did that on camera, but I cut a couple of trees. Um, then I just cut them up. Did half and half. Gives it a wee bit of depth. Right, I'm just going to add some leaves to the front of this. I thought about making a shaker, but then I was like... I want to try something different for a change. I've never done a open front with a piece inside before. I love this glass mug because you can put glue on it on it and it can manage to get it off. Uh, I've got another orange. That's one of the, this, oh my god, cannot talk. This is one of these kind of cards where you just could go forever and just add stuff. It's uh, quite addictive to just keep sticking pieces on. <laughs> Put some leaves up there a bit. Need some smaller ones. I wish I'd put that wee hedgehog on foam. I don't know if I'll be able to get it off. No, it's stuck fast. That's a shame. Maybe I'll make another one and put that on top. I think that looks good. I don't want to just keep going because I'll be here all night. But I really do like it. Something different. I got to use the Autumn Day stamp set, which is lovely. Oops. Probably might have a few more of these. Get a chance to use the acorns and the mushrooms and stuff thank you for watching please comment like and subscribe cheerio